Hello everyone. How to find the value of x in these exponential equations? Firstly, you can easy to see that one power x second ray is equals is equals one ray because we have the exponential rules. One power n equals equals also equals one ray. Right? So therefore, you can write one minus two power x equals a square root of two power x minus four four power x. Yes, and so in next step, you can take square up square up both hand sides. So therefore, we have one minus two power x whole power square equals two power x minus four power x. Yes, and so you can write one minus two power x whole power square equals two power x you can write two power x times one right and four power x you can write two times two whole power whole power x and so we can say one minus two power x whole power square equals two power x times one and so for in for here we can have a times b for whole power n equals a power n times b power n so therefore we can write two power x times two power x yes and so one minus two power x whole power square equals you can take two power x out in brackets we have one minus two power x yes and then everyone can see we have the common common factor so therefore you need to move the the right hand side for the left hand side one minus two power x whole power square minus one minus two power x times two two power x equals equals zero right and then one minus two power x times one minus two power x yes and minus minus two power x equals equals zero so we have two cases of that Firstly, case one, we have minus two, two power x equals equals zero, right? And then here is equal zero to or one minus two power x minus two power x equals equals zero, right? And so for case number one, we can write two power x equals equals one, yes? So it's easy to see that two power x equals equal two power two power zero and equals equals one, right? Therefore we have x equals x equals zero. Yes, we have yes a value of x equals zero from case number one. So we need to find for case number two to find the value of x here. You can write one minus two times two power x equals zero yes and so you can write one equals two times two power x and so you can write two power x equals a half yes and so you can write two power x equals equal two power minus one yes it's so easy yes and then in this case we can have the value as x equals here minus minus one yes so we have the value of x x one equals zero and x two equals minus one thank you for watching my video don't forget to subscribe my channel love you all Bye-bye. See you.